Hi everybody, this is Johnny. Let's make a game together. For this game, you will need paper, something to write with or draw, some playing pieces, especially a, some dice, and maybe a bear. So this game is called Climb a Mountain. To start this game, find a place on the bottom down here of your paper and write the number five. And keep counting up six, seven, eight, and nine. That's enough. And then now down four, three, two, one. And for this game, we'll need to have zero. Now give yourself a little space above the numbers and draw a line, maybe from about the one all the way about to the nine. And then draw another line near the top, leaving a little space. Looks interesting so far, but it's going to get better. Watch. Take this side and draw the side of your mountain. Take this side and draw the other side of your mountain. Okay. And if it's a good mountain, there might be some trees down at the bottom. You decide how many trees you want to have. And there might be some snow at the top, don't you think? So far, so good. Let's add something to this, okay? So let's put the number 100 at the very top. That's going to be our goal for the game. We're trying to count up to 100. And about the middle of this side, let's go ahead and put a 50, and then a 60, a 70, an 80, a 90, and then down 40, 30, 20, 10, and 0. Let's do the same for the other side. About midway around 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 100. Let's make that 6 a bit better. And how about 40, 30, 20, 10, and 0. The last thing we need right now is the title. This is called Climb a Mountain. Now I want you to do one more thing on this. We should put something special around one of the numbers. Now I chose the number 5. You can choose any number you want. This is going to be the slippery stone. It's the one you don't want to land on, so let's keep that one in mind. Now we need a couple players. Over here, let's see, a little curve here, a couple round circles, and one there too. Maybe a curve underneath, and maybe an ear. And then maybe some hair. Oh, gotta have some eyes, right? And eyebrows. And this person is Rolf, one of the players. And over here, a little curve, a couple circles, maybe a different shape circle there. And then an arc underneath, and maybe some ears. And let's see. some eyebrows and eyes and this person is Anna. So Rolf and Anna are going to be playing this game. So let's get started. If we put it this way, now what we need for playing pieces, well we'll need a dice and for this game each player needs to have two of something. I'm going to use these shiny coins copper coins for Rolf and the shiny silver ones for Anna. And what we're trying to do is count our way up these stones. These are the stepping stones. And once we get past a certain number of them, if we get to 10, we need to go to the next level. And we go climbing up the stones more. If we get 10 more, we'll go up to 20, climbing up our stones. If we get 10 more, we'll go up to 30. And the goal is to be the first person to reach to 100. So let's put down one coin here, underneath the zero, and another one on the side over here, and Anna for the same, 
Anna needs to have one coin down here, and then one at the base of the mountain. So one at the base of the mountain, and one coin ready for the stepping stones. So Rolf is going to begin, and Rolf rolls a four to begin with. Rolf is going to go one, two, three, four. And then Anna is going to take a turn, and Anna rolls a five. One, two, three, four, five. Now, normally, Anna would have to go down by ten if she hit the slippery stone, but she hasn't climbed yet, so she's okay at this point. Let's keep going. Rolf's turn. Rolf rolls a four. One, two, three, four. Rolf is all the way up to eight. And Anna? Anna rolls a four. One, two, three, four. Right now, Anna's just a little bit ahead. Rolf's turn. Rolf rolls a two. Now watch what happens. This is eight, one, two. So eight and two more actually takes us to ten, right? Looks like we're on zero. But Rolf is going to move his coin up here because now he's at ten and zero more. Ten and zero more. So he's making his way up to 100. Time for Anna. Anna rolls a one. So Anna, nine and one more will take us to ten as well. And so Anna makes the first step up the mountain. Rolf's turn. Rolf rolls a six. One, two, three, four, five. Miss the slippery stone. Six. Anna's turn. Anna rolls a one. So Anna right now is at ten and one. And Rolf is at ten and six. Rolf's turn. Rolf rolls a four. Six and four more. Think about what happens. One, two, three, four more. That means Rolf, get, um, Rolf gets to go up ten more, up to twenty. So Rolf is at twenty. Anna's turn. Anna rolls a three. One, two, three. Close to the slippery stone. Rolf rolls. Rolf rolls a one. Not a very good step. Anna's turn. Anna rolls a one. Look what happens. Anna hits the slippery stone again. And because Anna hit the slippery stone, she has to go down by 10. She's all the way back to down to here. So instead of being at 15, she's now at just 5. So let's keep going. Rolf's turn. Rolf rolls a 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. What just happened to poor Rolf? Rolf has lost 10 too, so instead of being at 25, he's now at 15. He has to go down by 10 as well. Let's play a little bit more. Anna's turn. Anna makes a 2, 1, 2. Rolf's turn. Rolf rolls a 1. Anna's turn. Anna rolls a 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. She's made 10 more, so she's now at 10 and 3. And right now, Rolf is at 10 and 6, so it's pretty close. This is for Rolf. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And Rolf has gone up another 10, so Rolf is now at 20 and 1. And Anna is at 10 and 3. And we keep going back and forth this way until either Rolf or Anna, or maybe you and a friend, Climb the mountain all the way up to 100. So this game is called Climb a Mountain. And for this game, you needed to have some paper. You needed to have something to write with. You needed to have a dice. You needed to have some playing pieces. And you probably needed to have a bear. I do hope you enjoy this game. I'll have another one for you soon.